this piece of furniture was actually made by pulling carbon and oxygen out of air and greenhouse gas and turning it into a piece of plastic. What if greenhouse gas emissions were as valuable as oil? What if the products we made actually improved the environment? On a continuous, large-scale basis, we're converting greenhouse gases such as methane and carbon dioxide into biodegradable plastic. Plastic that requires no oil, no food crops, and can be made into products that offer true cradle-to-cradle -cradle sustainability, starting and finishing as greenhouse gas. Right now, most plastics are made from oil and other fossil fuels. At the same time, we're emitting billions of pounds of carbon into the air every single day. Those gases can come from a range of sources, including wastewater treatment plants, landfills, and digesters. What happens is we take that gas, put it in the tank, and it becomes a plastic pellet, and then form it into things like film. So we now make this a strong film that's used for different applications, including packaging. But what is equally interesting is this. New Light's plastics can significantly outcompete oil-based commodity plastics on price. This is something that hasn't been done before. Typically, when you have a sustainable resin, you either have to give up on performance or pricing. We're talking about a high magnitude opportunity in the kinds of resins that we're making and the places that we're looking to go. 